Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you a Chrome browser extension called Chrome to Phone. I'm actually going to show it to you on my Chrome OS notebook. Although you do not need a Chrome OS notebook for this to work for you. All you need is a Chrome browser on your computer and an Android powered phone with Android 2.2 Froyo or greater on it. So basically, in order to use Chrome to Phone, you have to install a small extension on your Chrome browser and you have to install a small program on your Android powered phone. Now in order to put the extension on your Chrome browser all you need to do is pull up Google type in Chrome to phone and the first link that pops up it's going to be the Chrome to phone extension you click on it it'll bring you to the Chrome to phone website and then you install the extension I already have the Chrome to phone extension installed on my Chrome it's up here in the right hand corner upper right hand corner so I don't need to do that now as far as your Android phone you just go to the Android marketplace and you look up Chrome to phone and you download the app for that and then you sync it together and you're ready to go now basically for this video I want to show you how Chrome to phone works now Chrome to phone comes in handy when maybe you're at home you're surfing the internet and you have to take a train ride a long car ride or you know basically you just want to push whatever you're looking at on the internet to your phone so you can look at it there for later so right here are the pretty much the features of Chrome to phone you can send browser links from Chrome the browser to your phone uh, Google Maps links launch the Google Maps application on Android so that would come in handy if you want directions or or something like that uh, it sends YouTube links and it will launch your YouTube application to uh, on your Android phone and if you're surfing and you want to call a, a business or whatever if anything has a phone number listed online you can highlight it hit Chrome to phone it'll send it to your phone and your dialer will automatically launch and then you can just dial it from there and you can also select text on a web page and it'll uh, copy it over to the clipboard on Android so it's a very useful tool I'm going to show you pretty much just pushing over web web pages over to it okay I'm here on my YouTube page here with all my videos here and I'm just gonna click on one of them this is one of my latest ones overclocking a PC or actually overclocking a CPU okay maybe I want to uh, load up this video and check it out later on my phone so I have it here all I need to do is go up to the upper right hand corner up here where I have the Chrome to phone icon and click on it and it's gonna send it to my phone now if you can see here it says complete action using browser or YouTube so I can hit it and go to the browser and it would just show up like this or I could hit YouTube and it should show up on the YouTube player and it's loading up right now and there we go there's a video okay, it's playing right here? there okay let's show you that one more time and show you how quick it responds how quick once you hit the Chrome to phone button on your browser it sends it straight to your phone now right in front of you here we have a story pulled up from ngadget.com it just so happens that it's a Android related story uh, it outlines T-Mobile's release date for their new phones and, and tablets one of which that catches my eye is the LG, LG G Slate uh, which is a Android 3.0 honeycomb tablet which is rumored to be in 3D without glasses so that catches my eye right there because that sounds like something I might want to have now the question is do I want that or the Motorola Zoom which comes out I believe February 17th but that's for another video right now we're doing Chrome to phone so right here I have this story from Engadget I want to send it straight to my phone so I'm gonna bring my phone right up here and you're gonna see how quick it how quick it is just to send that over I'm gonna to go to the upper right hand corner where the Chrome to phone button is and I'm gonna click on that and I'll send it right to my phone and it brings up the same story right there see how quick that was now you can actually set the Chrome to phone to actually go to a, uh, a notification instead of just instantly pushing to your phone if that's pr what you prefer uh, which actually might work out well if you have more than one thing that you want to push to your phone 
That way you'll have a list of things and you can address it when you want. But that's pretty much Chrome to phone. It's a great tool to send your content from your computer to your phone if you're going to be switching from one environment to the next. So that's pretty much it for this video. I'll see you next time. <laughs>